The U.S. will announce Operation Prosperity Guardian tomorrow, and the operation will be an international effort to deal with the Houthis and their continued attacks on commercial shipping. And this is happening because at least five massive shipping companies, including the world's largest shipping company and several oil companies, are avoiding the Red Sea due to Houthis' attacks. And so shipping costs and oil prices are expected to skyrocket if companies have to start going around Africa instead of using the Suez. And all this is the U.S. is reportedly weighing the option of striking the Houthis directly, with the USS Eisenhower, right, an aircraft carrier being ordered out of the Persian Gulf into the Red Sea, traveling over 2,000 miles in less than a week as the U.S. prepares for the potential action. And the USS Laboon has now entered the Red Sea, joining the Mason and Kearney, with the U.S. also sending three more destroyers to the Mediterranean, and U.S. Central Command tweeted a picture of an A-10 preparing to launch in what appears to be a not-so-subtle subtweet to the Houthis. And over the weekend, we saw the USS Kearney shooting down a swarm of 14 drones, with the France and the U.K. also shooting down drones this past week. And this is the Houthis claim they're only attacking Israeli-affiliated ships and ships heading to Israeli ports. However, they have struck several ships that have nothing to do with Israel. But hey, follow to stay in the loop.